help. Where in a public space, ma'am? Ask what it's for to make sure they're comfortable being recorded. Well, it's a public building. Right. A gentleman I can sing to the town hall recording people, potentially a free stater. Who called? Called who? Called you. Oh, I'm just here to drop some stuff off. No, you're not. Don't lie to me. I heard it on the radio. Huh? You're a liar. Hey. You want to rat me out? Wow. Do you need something? Yeah, I need you not to lie to me. Okay. Did you get a call? It says right here. <laughs> Sorry. I did tell you. You're a pig. Liar. You want my name? It's right there. That's the pignorance. Can you get Sammy clear? Wait, Jake. Hello? 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 You're clear. Dismissed. What's going on, everyone? This is Press NH Now over here today in the town of Holderness, New Hampshire at the Town Hall. We're going to be conducting a First Amendment audit to see if they respect our rights to film here in public. Today's date is March 2nd, 2022. Please make sure you go like, share, and subscribe to my channel at Press NH Now. I appreciate all of your support. Also check out my playlist to see some videos you might not have seen in the past. Hit that like button, let all your friends and family know about my activism in and around the New England states. Donations, everyone, is greatly appreciated. They do help me continue my activism all around the New England states. And we're going to get right to it here, guys. Appreciate all your support. Enjoy the video. Always check description. All links are included. Holderness Town Hall. Downstairs. Yeah. <laughs> Recreation director. Oh, I'm sorry. Me. Good. That's right. I was just hitting here. Oh, after. sorry about that. The town out town administrator. Yes, sir. You have a business card? Uh, no, I don't. You don't have any business cards? No. Nope. Why not? Huh? Not I that have... important, or? <laughs> no, we have we have all our contact information on the website. Everything's online. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Thank you. You're very welcome. Do you know that there's like a recreation department? Okay. Yeah. Right. That's what all the cars are out there for. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I saw all the cars, but not a lot of people. Yeah. Nice. Have you been, did you go downstairs? I did. I'm just going to take a little tour around. Are you, um, is that live? Well, it's recording, yeah. Okay. Can I just, before you do that, can I ask what it's for to make sure they're comfortable being recorded? Well, it's a public building. Right. Yeah. So feelings really don't matter. I mean, it's my rights to film in a public building. So no expectation of privacy in public. Where in a public space, ma'am? But it's a private class. But this is a public building. No, you need Not at all. Okay. This camera's everywhere you go, ma'am. She's going to wrap me out. Hey, want to wrap me out? 
Well, yeah. Awkward. It's awkward, but it's legal. Well, then they should stay at home and put the blinds down. We're in public. And do I need any sticker to put on the plate? What are you doing? Uh, um, no, you use the same ones because you already... Because the sticker you put on the Well, I live in Holdenus, and it's down up my street in the place called Hawkins Hill Road. So this must be her office. There is in a bracket that says discontinued. Does that mean that the road is discontinued? Let me see the text now. Yeah. Is Alan going to be here tomorrow? Hey. How are you doing? Um, those are a young lady from the recreation department. Did she come and speak with you? or? Can I just ask what the concern is? She just asked a question. She wanted to know why you're in the building, and I said, well, it's a public building. It's a public building. Right. Yeah. yeah, I'm not here to disturb anybody. Yeah. Okay. Did she understand that now? or? Yeah, I think we're good. I don't know why she had a problem with me in the first well, place. I, again, you know, some people, it's all good. I hope so. Yeah. Okay. Because okay. I'm going to go back in there, and I'm going to document what's going on in the recreation department. And I really don't want any further issues with anybody in there. Okay. Okay, and if you could explain that to the staff or the people that are here that we're in a public building, I do have a right to do this. That would be great. Okay. Okay? We don't need to escalate this into something that's not... Understood. You know what I mean? Yep. All right, can I just get your name? My name is Michael Capone. Michael what? Michael Capone. I'm town administrator. Town administrator. Yep. Right yeah, I just didn't know your name. Yep. Okay. All right, thank you. Thank you Appreciate it. You too. Go back over to the recreation department. Hey, I'm not here to disturb you, please. Okay, I'll be here till then. No, I cannot. No, I don't have to answer your questions. I'm sorry? It's right here. Well, tell me your name. It says right here. <laughs> Sorry. I did quiet. tell you. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. What are you doing? Okay. See, I told you it says right here. Do you have any brochures for the class? Yeah, downstairs on the. Um, what is what is that's exactly that's and what is the class about? Just knitting or? Uh, this one's called Blankets for Project Linus. Okay. It's a charity program making blankets to give to kids that are in um, uh, hospitals. Okay. And things like that. Okay. And so so they volunteer and do this or? They signed up for the program. Yeah. Yeah. yeah through the town. Yeah. Okay. Nice.
It's, it's interesting. I mean, that's what I'm here for, you know. I'm just trying to get some public information. See, people need to understand, not to be rude, but people need to understand that we have rights. And my rights are to film in a public building no matter how they feel. And I'm not here to be rude. I'm not here to disturb your class. I know it's a little uncomfortable sometimes, but there's cameras everywhere we go around this country. And just because mine's mobile doesn't make it any different. Do you know what I mean? So it's just, it's, it's facts, it's law. It's actually the Constitution. The flyers downstairs? Yeah. The more people that are educated on our rights, the better off this country will be. Feelings aside. Where are you going to show this? I I have my sources that I put online and stuff. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. I can't answer that, ma'am. That's not it. How many classes does it take to usually make a blanket? First time we've done it, so it's a two hour window of time. We started at one. So these blankets were actually made in two hours? Yep. Oh, wow. Interesting. I appreciate your time in uh, doing this for the kids. A lot of people in the public like to see these type of activities in the towns. Maybe more people will sign up now because of my recording. And more children can get more blankets. I know, but well, I'm here to educate people on their rights and understand the laws. I think everybody has a basic understanding now. We'll get the brochure downstairs, and uh, if anybody wants to sign up to help make blankets for children in the hospitals, um, they know where to go and they'll know where to sign up. All right, bye, Jenny, thanks. See you. All right, close check. Bye, Jenny. Switch back to true time. Where would the brochures be downstairs? Uh, they're right in front of the town clerk's office on the chest in the lobby. Okay. Right across from the front door. All right. And um, do you have a business card? Or? They're pink. No. You, you don't? What's your name? Wendy Werner. It's a good Okay. Yep. Thank you, Wendy. Sure. I appreciate it. Thank you, ladies. Have a good day. Bye, Jenny. And that's that. This took an in house report of a gentleman acting strange at the town hall recording people, potentially a three stater, and then writ to check. Oh, they're calling in. Uh, yep. Let me get service real quick. Yeah. 
So there's the call. I had a feeling it wasn't over. Acting strangely. I am not part of any Free State project. Not associated with any Free State project in New Hampshire. I am independent. Who called the police department? Did somebody call the police department? No, well, I didn't. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, somebody did. <laughs> I was apparently acting strangely. Well, it was a little strange. Yeah, but it's our rights to do so. People need to understand that. Yeah. You know, we have rights and then there's feelings and they need to put those aside. There's nothing well, scary about a camp. I've heard that you told my so I don't think anything Yeah, see, so. It's kind of strange. To call the police on somebody exercising their rights these days, you know? I think that's pretty strange. Huh. Hopefully she doesn't violate my rights now, huh? We'll see. Oh, I'm worried about it. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. She didn't call if that's what you're wondering. Who? Her. I know. You do know? Who called? Called who? Called you. Oh, I'm just here to drop some stuff off. No, you're not. Don't lie to me. I heard it on the radio. Huh? You're a liar. What's your name and batch number? I have a radio. I hear everything you're saying. Okay. You did get a call. What's your name? Huh? What's your name? Bree. What is it? Bree. Bree? Yep. You have a badge number, Bree? Yeah, number two. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you're very welcome. Yeah, so why you lie to me? Why did you lie you to me? me in? Do you mind buzzing me in? Thank Do you me. mind not lying to the public, please? Yeah. You got a call, didn't you? A free state, right? Sure. Sure. You're gonna lie to me? You, you, you're not gonna. You're not gonna something? hold back on that. Do you need something? Yeah, I need you not to lie to me. Okay. Did you get a call? Listen. Did you get a call? Because I'm gonna pull the call number and I'm gonna pull the records. I need to know if there was a call. All right. Sounds good. You're a liar. Yeah. Just like the typical police pigs, huh? I know, you laugh all you want. I know I got a call. See, she's a typical liar, pig. That's what they do to everyone. They lie to you. I heard the call on my radio, okay? There was a call for service here for somebody, a strange activity. And she blatantly lied to my face because that's what they do. Well, she's here to uphold my uphold uh, her oath and my rights, and she already lied to me. What's that tell you? Yeah, I, I'm not interested in this conversation. Yeah, that's okay. I'm not required to have this conversation with you. I'm pretty sure. No, you don't have to. Just shows typical government who lie. That's why I have a scanner. Let's call them out on their bull. Let's go take a look at her vehicle. Let her know. So that's Holderness Police Department straight up lying to me about a call for service. Oh, you left your computer up. Cool. Why are you lying to me? You want to turn that backwards or start off again? Or good. What's your ID? What's your uh, call number? Number two, I told you. No, the call number on this call. <laughs> You're a <laughs> pig. Liar. You look like <laughs> Holderness just for straight up lying to me. I have a scanner, Bree. See? You're dismissed. Bye. You're dismissed, you liar.
just dropping something off. Incredible. She could have just easily told me that she got a call for strange activity, but no, she had to lie to me. You're clear. Dismissed. Hi. Get back on the road. And I'm not part of any free state project, so you can cross that off your list. She's just gonna sit around now. Car number four. You gonna go back to work? Isn't there any crime out there? Is this what you do? Just sit around and lie to people? I know, what are you smiling about? Why don't you just tell me you got a call? It's very simple. You look like shit to the general public by lying to them straight to their face when I heard it straight on the scanner. I know, you just roll your eyes, right? You work for us, remember that. Now your whole department is gonna look like shit because you wanna lie to me. What's the call number? So I can pull the report. 52. 52. Do you have a call number? <laughs> I'm gonna pull your report and I'm gonna see if there's any more bull in there. Okay? So make sure you don't lie. Gonna be all online. You should probably put your screen down next time too. Huh. She's waving like she gives about us. She don't care about the public. She lies straight up to them. Straight up blue line gang. That's all you are. Typical liars. Sitting around doing nothing. Let them know. You want my name? It's right there. That's the pignorance. Now she's on private property.
Now she's sitting on private property. Look at her. Brie. Officer Bree. All right, well, that's going to be it over here today at the town of Holderness Town Hall in New Hampshire. I appreciate all your support, guys. Please make sure you go like, share, and subscribe to my channel at Press NH Now. Also, check out my playlist to see some of those videos that you might not have seen in the past. Hit that like button. Let all of your friends and family know about my activism in and around the New England states. Always check your description. All links are included. Donations are greatly appreciated as they do help me continue my activism in and around the New England states. It was a little hostile here in the recreation department um, with the class that was going on. Uh, they were making blankets for children in the hospitals and who are in need, uh, which is a great class, by the way. Um, go check it out. Wendy in the recreation department uh, is running the show in there. The town administrator um, knows exactly what was going on and uh, put her in check and let her know that this is a public building in which they uh, in which they pass along to the people who were inside of the um, recreation department uh, doing the blankets so they're all well informed now that there's no expectation of privacy in public so please again hit that like on your way out and I'll see you in the comments press an H now over and out